Ah, Evelyn friendship. Yay! My whole clan could camp in here and you'd never even find them. We should move on. Okay. You have my thanks. Aveline was wise to bring you. She will make a fine captain. Yes, she will. I still ship you two. I still ship you two. <laughs> Please, please stop kicking the wall. Thank you. <laughs> the Viscount must be terribly busy. I've been waiting most of the day. All right. So. There must be mages in Tavinta who don't use blood magic. Of course, there are slaves. The magisters do not hesitate to collar their own kind. But no magisters. Why must you go on about this? No magister would turn down an advantage over his rivals. If he did, he'd be dead. You know, to use blood magic, you need to look a demon in the eye and accept his offer. I just figured some of them would say no. For aesthetic reasons, if nothing else. Your son has taken refuge with the Dalish. What? But he is human. They did not even wish me to raise him among them. But they do value magic more than the men of Kirkwall. Perhaps he can have both safety and freedom. As I said, I have little money. But this is a Dalish ring that has been in my family Aww. for generations. Please accept it with my thanks. Oh. The priest was asking after you again last week. Alright. Mero. This city is amazing. Do you know I saw someone get mugged? Right outside. It was fascinating. <laughs> Everything happens here all at once. How does anyone keep it all straight? My things are fascinating. Someone has jumped outside your door and that's exciting. It must be the alien age greeting. Hasn't happened to me yet though. They must not like me. <laughs> oh. It's so busy here. So many things just get lost. Have the Templars The Templars again? haven't found you, have they? I've been careful. Even among the Dalish. Keepers never work magic in public. And I think the Templars don't even see me. I'm just another elf in the alienage. Do you miss the Danish? I miss her and Pival stories. The creaking of Aravels in the breeze. Oh. The city is so busy and confusing. And the elves here are not like my clan. But I'll get used to Kirkwall in time. I'm not like you. Are you feeling lost here, Meryl? A bit. But I'll adjust. I'm glad you came by. I needed someone to talk to. <laughs> by the Dread Wolf! Why is my house always such a mess when people are here? It's clean sometimes, I swear. We should move on. You showed the boy Fainriel great mercy. Yeah. You will live better among the Dalish than anywhere in Kirkwall. Yeah. Letters than I do. 
There's another one on the desk. Thank you. Hmm. Bad sign. Sign of the Hawk family. I dare not contact you directly, but we have met before, and I know you to be a person of good character and unusual ability. Indulge me in meeting outside the city, for I require your aid in a delicate task as a token of good faith. I have enclosed a modest sum. There will be more waiting if you can help. Please come as soon as you receive this. If you do, if you do not, the lives of many innocents may be on my hands. Sincerely, a friend. All right, let's accept it. Bethany. I hope Mother convinces the Viscount to give us the estate. And well, hopefully, I helped out a bit on that. Never a shortage of idiots who think they can take the streets in the dark. But, good reward in getting rid of them. Alright. Let's take care of... Ah... Uh, Wrong way. Oh. Why, hello there. Remember me? Oh, no. You still owe me from what you gave to that urchin. Since you've done so well for yourself. Are you joking? I've done so well because I've carved my way through half of Kirkwall. You really want to cross me. You spurned my offer and lost us some serious coin. I intend to take what you owe with interest. Yeah, no. Sorry, Fenro. You are not allowed to do that, Asenia. You're not allowed. Alright, where are we? There's more of you. Alright. We should move on. It's pretty here at night. Once the nobles are out of the way, you can really admire the scenery. The people here. They never leave High Town's fancy walls. They have no idea what's brewing below them. Mm. Alright. Took care of that problem. <laughs> Interesting place. If someone here tries to hire me again, I'm leaving. <laughs> Madame Lucine runs the place for Harlan. Or with him. Or on him. It's a coterie thing. Okay. Interesting place. Do you need something, honey? You don't work here, do you? With the customers. You're no prize yourself, sweetheart. Is there something you want? A couple of Templar recruits went missing. They were last seen here. You'll have to be more specific. We do a lot of business with the Templars. People fly start stage with Templars. I'll make it worth their while. Perhaps a few coins can loosen your lips. Are you trying to bribe me? You know, not all the girls here are for sale. I'm going to pretend that didn't happen. Okay. 
Pickles wives. We have a lot of missing Templars. If we don't act quickly, we may only find corpses. Now, now, no need to get all dramatic on me. Let me look through the books. Wilmud, Karen. Here we go. Wilmud came in here a lot. You sure he had time to be a Templar? <laughs> the both of them last saw Iduna, the exotic wonder from the east. The exotic wonder. <laughs> That's quite the stage name. It sounds better than the tramp from Darktown. You should hear what some of the others are called. <laughs> Do you know anything else? Is there anything else you can tell me? Honey, I could write volumes on the things I know. Oh. Unless you want Wilmud's favorite position, I think you have what you need. You didn't hear any of this from me. We clear? Master uh, Scott, can you teach me to make a shiv now? You promised. Uh, uh, what? I've got your usual mm -hmm. ready and waiting for you upstairs, Sarah. Many thanks. Alright, let's speak with this exotic wonder of the I thought all dwarves east. had beards. Where's yours? I misplaced it, along with my sense of dwarven pride and my gold-plated noble cast pin. I thought maybe it fell onto your chest. <laughs> oh, the broody elf tells a joke. I don't brood. Yeah, you Friend, do, if you were brooding right yeah, more you impressive, do. women would swoon as you passed. They'd have broody babies in your honor. They're a very odd dwarf. And you thought I was joking about the pit. Iduna, right? Do you remember entertaining a Templar named Wilmot a few weeks ago? Or Karen? Wilmot. Wilmot. That doesn't sound familiar. Drop the act. Do your clients like this charade? It must get dreadfully tiresome. What, uh, whatever do you mean? Questions are boring. Why don't we have some real fun? Uh. Hawk, go easy on this lovely creature. <laughs> you should listen to your friend. What's wrong with you? You really are persistent. As charming and relentless as you are, I'm here to investigate. Answer one of my questions first. Who told you about little old me? I heard a rumor. It was Vivica. She showed me her books. Wow. Wasn't so hard, was it? So Vivica sold me out, did she? That drab, pathetic little sewer rat. She will be dealt with. Oh no. Oh no. Just do one more thing for me. Draw your blade and bring it gently across your throat. No. No. Anders, make a stop. Let go of my friends. How did you? Oh shit! Spare me, Monsieur. How did you do that? What foul magic was that? Blood and desire in equal measure. An art I learned from elsewhere. Okay. Blood magic, then? Yes, Monsieur. Ooh. Please don't kill me. Tell me everything now. You're going to answer all my questions. And if there's even a hint of magic. Tarani put me here, to send biddable Templar recruits to the Sanctuary. 
Three Spear Alley in the Undercity. I enchanted Wilmot and Keren weeks ago. But after they left these walls, I know not what came of them. Please, let me live. It's not my fault. It was all Tarane's idea. Tell me about Tarane. She put me up to this. She said we can recreate the ancient Imperium. Mm. That mages mm. can rule again, not serve. She says the Templars cannot hold against us if we stand up and fight. This base of yours. How many other mages are there? Any other defenses? People go in and out all the time. Sometimes a handful, sometimes more. There are traps. Magical traps. There's a hidden switch at the front. It turns them off. That's all I know. Okay, so she's not fond of the Templars, as you know, but she figures mages like her are what the circle is made for. It, in her ideal world, only bad mages would be sent to the circle and dealt with and imprisoned. And that's sort of her philosophy. Go to the go to the Templars if you're a bad mage, but if you're a good mage, you can be free. That's the deal. That's her opinion. So she's going to tell her to go to the Templars. The Templars are coming for you. No more of your tricks. Next stop the sanctuary and some answers. Alright. You have been a good friend. Better than I deserve. We should move on. This place reminds me way too much of the Merchant's Guild. <laughs> uh, that says volumes of your opinion on, on the Merchant's Guild. <laughs> oh. Oh. Um. That's... that's my thought. <laughs> Ooh, we have the specialization point. Ooh, so I usually cut the... cut this out, but since we have the specialization point, I am going to be telling you which specialization that our Marian is going to be. And that is going to be the Templar specialization. And what you're probably saying is like, what? But she hates the Templars. Well, she is going down the Templar path in order she likes the fact that she can fight bad she is going to use this power to fight the bad mages and protect the good mages and uh, So basically she's going to be using the specialization to do what the Templars of Kirkwall are not doing, is protecting innocent mages and getting rid of the bad mages that do bad things. So that's... So, to read this, um, the Templar, the strong arm of the Chantry, Templars serve as guardians of the circles of Magi, hunters of apostates and Maleficarum, and rarely as a standing army in the at the command of the Divine, through ingestion of carefully prepared lyrium, Templars gain resistance to magic, including the ability to interrupt spells. 
to the chantry, though the chantry controls the lyrium trade, those with the right connections can acquire enough to uh, emulate the abilities of those vigilant warriors. Templar must be purchased using a specialization point before any talents may be taken in this tree. Specialization points are granted at level 7 and 14. Damage plus 10% versus spellcasters and fade creatures. So, Templar. Yes. And... Which is going to be pr this is going to be pretty fun, pretty interesting. And for our ability point, we will start on this tree by taking Holy Smite. The Templar sh strikes out with condemning fire, inflicting spirit damage on nearby enemies. Spirit damage 24. Diameter 8 meters, cost 35 stamina, slow down, cooldown 25 seconds, type activated ability. Brilliant. I will see, see you guys after I take care of the other characters. Alright, perfect. Market's closed. Come back in the morning. I know, I know. Half of Ferelden is packed into this stinking place. They'd have done better to fight the Darkspawn. You know what I love about the Undercity? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> we should move on. Okay, Fairness. No comments, okay. We should go carefully. Who knows what this many blood mages may have summoned to defend themselves. Let's go. Oh.
Well, they're already dead. So... Okay. How wonderful. More vessels for our experiments. Where is um. Karen? Perhaps the demons will find one of you suitable. Always the demon thing. Can't you people say no? <laughs> some hopeless waif that ran crying to a demon. I sought them out and embraced them. Why have you taken the recruits? Demons can inhabit much more than mages and corpses. With assistance, they can control anyone I ask. Any Templar, any noble. Any well-meaning meddler. I'm no easy pro. You do know I cut a path through your abominations, right? Good, good. The demons like spirit. If a few more Templars fall to the demons, we can seed chaos in their ranks. How many abominations can they discover amongst their own before it drives the Knight Commander crazy? Where are they? Tell me where Karen is. The experiments need so much fuel, you see. So many living vessels are found wanting. Useless vessels can still feed the compost heap, so it's not a complete waste. The demons are using you. Fight them. In days of old, the Tevinter Imperium spanned the known world. Demons were their allies, held in check by power and knowledge. With a wave of a hand, I could do more than a Templar can achieve in a lifetime. Yet they command us! Absurd! We should be ruling them! We should rule you all! 